Uh, my game disappeared. Oh no. Help. There it is. <sighs> Hello, welcome to my stream, where I have no idea what's going on any more than you do. But I'm just here for the spooks, <laughs> so... Uh, we're gonna... Okay, oh, I'm gonna have to turn that down. That's loud. Oh, goodness. Pardon if my game disappears again. I have to turn this down just a little. Oh, that's very loud. Okay. The sound on your end is not going to change. The sound on mine is. Alright. I have no idea what the frick is going on. Just for reference. So, uh... Do not fault me if I screw up. How long is this game, by the way? Hello? Okay, can't even interact with that. Hi! I have such visions to share with thee. Oh, do you? My jaw be unshackled, and you harvest the crust from my eyes. I don't want your eye crust. Ew! Excuse me. Nice shirt. May 1st, 1899. But then, what if they could stand upright and walk as men? What if the brute were harnessed thus? Would they sing? Would they find their own god? I have seen these things and I will tell you now. No. No, they will not. But they will happily accept fealty to a god thrust upon them and worship it thus given. In this I realize they are no different to the masses. They are much the same as us. Once this irrevocable threshold is passed, I understand that we too are shackled and must be set free. To free the man, we cut the man. What if the, the fa? In order to cross that great evolutionary line, it must first be painted upon the ground. I feel like your logic is a little askewed, sir. Um. Good, great. All of this makes perfect sense. I know exactly what's going on. Why is the music getting louder? I don't like that. August 22nd. In America, they talk of building their cities to the skies. To me, this seems folly. But perhaps it is simply a case of a nation founded without a history of its own. We walk upon our histories. They are compacted into the very loom beneath our feet. The engineers we employed talked of thus. They talked of how, when building the underground trains, they would often come across older tunnels crisscrossing the capital. What palaces lie buried beneath us? We are digging, digging, excavating, and reappropriating what we find. At the center of the planet, my Arctic tells me, there is a great iron ball. It is the egg of the world. That would be the core. There's a movie about that. Ooh! I hope those are dentures and not real because that's disgusting. Okay, cool, great. What the frick? Are you- are you good, ma'am? Are you okay? Oh, send help. Send help for everyone involved. Okay, um... Good, great, but why are you kissing a duck? I'm... Alice! A hey, demon raid time, let's go! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Did you raid into the duck- the duck kissing? Yeah, that- that's- that's where we are right now. Duck kissing is apparently legal, and... Oh, apparently that's it. Okay, I don't know. If you can't understand by the title, um, I have no idea what the frick is- are you following me? 
Listen, I don't like that you're following me. Quit. Stop it. Hey, what's going on, man? How you doing? How you doing? Oh my god, you finally beat it? You've been on that for a hot minute. <laughs> wow, good job. Great job. Yeah, right? Um, where am I supposed to go? What am I supposed to look at? What are we doing? This is... You're excited to play the next one, right? Can I look at this? Nope. Okay. What if I throw the chair away? Can I look at this then? No. Okay, fair enough. Fine. I've looked at everything. Biblia. Bibleho. Bibleho? Bibleho. Oh. Wait, have I. I've been this way, yes. Yes. Can I go out this door? Yes! Okay, cool. That's where I was supposed to go. Alright. Yeah, I need to go back and finish Persona 3. I got a little ways into it, and I just totally for, like, forgot about it. I just got into a bunch of other life stuff, and I just have not been the same since. But I do need to finish it. Uh, it's just so damn long, and I just don't have the time to play games that are that long, you know? I actually can stream it, because I... I do have a cord that connects to my PS3, but I would have to remember how to do it because it's complicated. But yeah. It really do. It's like the longest game of existence. <laughs> oh my god. October 11th, 1899. We integrate the very la latest knowledges, knowledges of chemistry using low level of laudanum, laudanum? derivative and feed to subdue the product even before the initiation of the process. That means that we, when we drag them from holding pens onto the line, they are less likely to panic and damage machine components, other products, or themselves. This section of the belt is shredded, shredded? Sheathed in rubber and kept well, oh my god, I can't talk today, well lit to maintain good spirits. And we have actually found that the intelligent placement of gramophones and simple acoustic amplification tubes around the line means we can use music to further soothe the product. We find Debussy particularly effective in this regard. I love the way the, like, O's look. Good. <laughs> I might be silly. Okay. Um, when you say product, what do you mean? Do you mean pigs? Or machines? Or what? Human beings? I don't even know. Fueling pumps, volatile chemicals are in use. These materials are highly corrosive. Wear protection. Well... You mean I can't just run down here in the nude? How dare you limit me like this? How oh. Jesus. Disgusting! All these doors are locked. Wow. Except for that one. Um, do I need to look at this? I don't want to. They're dead pigs. That's exactly what they are. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. Um, what is this? Uh, fueling pumps. Okay, they're stuck right now, but that is something I need to look into. Oh, Alice, you right. Uh, shout yourself out. <laughs> you right for rating. You right. <laughs> if you're still here. You deserve it. You deserve it. You did good job today. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. Yes. I give Alice the gold star. 
She is best daemon. There are no other daemons above the Alice. September 28, 1899. Imagine, they say, a machine one day they might think like a man, as if this is to be desired. One might almost boast of creating a man who breeds like a pig. Men and women upon all fours, running careless. I'm not, I'm not going to say that. Alleys and gutters running freely with the careless spill of their conjoinings. <laughs> what the frick is this language? The, oh my god. Uh, no, I'm not talking about that. <sighs> Okay, let me see if there's anything I can talk about. No, this is not the machine we seek. Such an entity should be nothing less than a deity, and we will fall upon our knees and worship it. We shall not carve gods to, bi to bicker and fornicate. They will exist to clean the world and set us free. I reject Babbage as I reject these men of government. Let the pigs uh, copulate in the gutters while they can. We shall scoop them up and ease their essentials. What the frick is going on? Are they... Is it like pig? There's pig orgies going on? I don't know what the fuck is going on. Help. I'm so confused. Help. What is going on? No. I don't want to know. I don't want to know what's going on. I still don't have protection on. Ew, I don't want to touch it. Ew, I don't want to touch it. That's gross. Stop. Um... Okay. Ooh, truck fueling station. I... That's locked. I've checked everything, right? That's locked. That's locked, okay. Uh, that's open, open. I've checked everything in here. There's nothing I can... Ew, those are rats. That's gross. I picked that up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What's this? Oh, it's just a little wheel? Okay. Hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Apparently they're trying to make the perfect machine, but... And they're testing on animals, I think, is what's going on. And it just happens to be pigs that they're testing on? Question mark? Maybe? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Has something else been unlocked since I have been running around? Oh, well. I locked myself out. There were quite a few doors that were locked over here before that... Okay, well... Never mind. That's where I came from. Okay. What am I missing? What am I doing? What have I missed? <laughs> I don't know. I don't see anything worth looking at. Man. What have I missed? All the doors are locked. What do you mean? Is there... Am I supposed to put this like, on the truck or something? I don't like holding it. It's disgusting. Is that what I was supposed to do? I can still grab it, though. Ew. Am I supposed to move this? Am I supposed to put it on... On the thing? Uh, How slow I move when I'm carrying this thing. That's not a truck though. What 
if I put it over here. <laughs> what if Okay, no, that's not the answer. What if I put this? Eh. Throw it in the air. Okay, it fell. What if I sacrifice it to the gods? It says I have to wear protection. Wait, 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 Do I need to wear the mask? Is that the protection they're talking about? When you say wear protection, what do you mean? There's a lot of different ways that can go here. Okay, well, do I need to wear this? No, apparently not. It won't let me, won't let me pick it up. Well, tell me what to do, phone guy. You're smart. You can tell me what to do. I don't know. There's something. Mm, there's something here, but I can't. That was a good idea, though. I had a big brain moment, and apparently it didn't matter. What the frick? I just noticed that. Okay. How could this happen to me? I made my mistakes. What am I supposed to wear? There's nothing for me to change into. Like, what? Black wood? I can do what? Okay. You right. Uh, look this up. You right. You right. That's a great gif, by the way, on the on the tweet you just posted. I love that. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. Um I think I'm in chapter 2. Or chapter 3, I'm not sure. done that. So I'm on chapter 4 then. At least. You'll see a cart full of pigs. There it is. Wait, what? Hold on. Proceed to the room on the left. Okay. I th think they mean this. Okay, so there's a window. <gasps> Yes! Okay, thank you, guide. I am dumb. Thank you. I forgot that was a thing that I could do. Okay. Apparently I'm on chapter four. 
pull the box away from the door? Eh? Why? Why? How? How can I do this? Papa, let's climb this one. I can see more pictures at the top. Delivery schedule. How in blazes are we supposed to meet these damn schedules if even the basic equipment we are provided with simply will not perform its designated function? These cursed newfangled trucks will only run a fraction of the distance my my old nag managed before running out of sticking ga stinking gasoline. The gaffer says it's fine, and there's plenty of pumps to refill them outside of the factory. But you end up dragging a blessed tank from the truck to the nearest one to refill it, and the one in the storeroom is empty again. I can't be turning that crank handle all day to find the tank is empty. Well, sod it says I. Enough for a night, and to my bed I go. It's not like anyone needs access to the bleeding graveyard anyway. Harry, if you get this, I'll meet you in the Damson Templar for a jar. For a jar? Apparently that's what they call a pint these days. Okay. Though in those days, this is what we call a pint. Okay. Okay, so there's gonna be like a fuel canister somewhere nearby. Perhaps in here, yes. I'm sorry. Okay. Cool, thanks. I think this is a fuel canister? Is that- is it? <laughs> That's not like a fuel canister I've ever seen, but you know what? I've I trust. Okay, we're gonna go back through this area, put this where the crank is. Oh, I'm sorry. Frick was that? Get me the heck out of there. I don't like that. Okay. How do I get this to go? Turn the crank, but 
How do I reach it? This way? No. I cannot reach. No. Turn the crank at the front. Oh, this crank. Duh. Oh my god. Literally it moved back two centimeters. Are you serious? This way, Papa. Come and see. Will it hatch? Can we take it home? Wow. Yes, of course we can take it home. comes to me in the fairest disguise. We skips and we totters. I seize her hind trotters and enter her portion. What the freak? Why is everything about <laughs> sexual? Like, I like thighs too, but goddamn. Okay. Not like that. Alright. This game is disgusting. <laughs> We're kissing gooses, we're talking about pig orgies, and we're freaking... I don't even know. Where did I come from? This way? No? Where did I start from? The frick? Was it this way? No. This is new. November 23rd, 1899. Twin candles bent to the will of the central saint, casting their light to the corners of the chapel. Father Jeremiah, I thought, could be trusted with a secret, but he is like all the others. So the old priest has gone to the holding pens with his flock. He says he will enter into our world with them. Shepherd, indeed. Indeed! He needs indeed. Indeed, indeed. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, good. I haven't seen a monster yet. I've heard things. Oh, I came from this way. You're right, you're right, you're right. I came from this way. So I've been through the office. That's got nothing. There's an upstairs this way. Cool. Love this. <laughs> Love this. Oh. Hello? In the name of the Lord! I'm being reminded of, uh... In, um... Your faith shackles your vision, Professor. It is an iron coffin that keeps you from grasping the future. We require a new deity, one of steam and the wheel of magnetism and progress. The old uh -huh. god is nothing more than a lame hog, spitting back awful at mankind.
Uh... Oh, there is a missing candle. Oh. <gasps> Wait. You're right, so I need to find the missing candle. It's definitely not in here. Probably down one of these side areas. Oh, wait, I didn't get to see! <laughs> the door was stuck in my face! What? What kind of church is this? This is all kinds of... Mm. This is all kinds of... Mm. <laughs> oh, it's oh. Nice. Great. Cool. Fantastic. A great. What? Listen, Papa. Hold the egg to your ear. You can hear the sea. I can. Are you sure? <laughs> I hate this. These final thoughts. What exhumation is this? What rotten fruit? What bestitching of parts? I doubt I will ever be found, yet I leave you this. Scrawled in the melodi melodious? Melodorous? The what? Half light, whilst my tormentor shuffles below, my fellow prisoners keen and squeal in the gloom. And where I wait for the knocking upon my cage, that signifies it is, finally, my turn to make that dark journey into the interior. Alright. Uh, okay. All right, okay. All right, okay. Oh, all right, okay. I have no idea what's going on still, but that's okay. I don't need to know. My only job is to be here and be spooked. And so far, I am succeeding at the both of these things. No. Pardon me. Stuck, send help. Okay. 
Oh god, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. And so to the stoking! The workers sing as they work, they sing as they eat, they sing as they make toilet- oh, Okay. They, I've never heard that- <laughs> I've never heard going to the bathroom use that. They're always singing. If you place your ear to the ground, you can hear them still. Okay. That is all for that chapter, I suppose. How do I even turn my lantern on? <gasps> I didn't even know I could do that. Okay, alright, okay. I didn't even know that was possible. I could have died. And yet, I did not. Why am I still whispering? The monster's not here right now. Why am I still whispering? Oh, there's another fueling station. Do I- do I need the fueling station now? I don't know. Probably not. Oh, hello. I'm on the other side now. Water in his shoes. Always the water, and the sparks of the embers of the wheels. It's too bony! It's too damn bony! They would shackle the masses to a wheel and turn it till their backs break. All for that opiate, the lure of profit. These fools who lackey them, these priests, these officials, this government. They make pigs of us all. But what solution, my dear man? How to break a cycle? You cannot simply remove the promise of a better world for these unfortunates. In the workhouses, in the orphanages, the belief in heaven is surely the only sucker one can find. We do not need to wait. We can bring forth paradise now. We can speed the passion. With only a small sacrifice, we can hold the apocalypse. With just a small sacrifice, we can free our shackles and deliver them to paradise now. understand literally anything about what's going on, but okay. I will try my best to understand. For you, man. 
I guess. I feel like an engineer.
or something? Question mark? I follow him, where he leads, will he lead me to where I need to go? What? But I've already lost track. Pause. Hang on. I'm supposed to jump down into a coal pile, but I can't see anything. Oh, right here? Okay. Found it!
In the rest of the bags, the factory is quiet now, so Wen Yale and Wen Chung loosely from his hand, oil and grease dripping off of it. I did not get to read the rest of that. That's okay. Oh! Oh! Well, he did. Death by elevator. Rip. Rip GG. That's the end of that. <laughs> See y'all later. No, I'm just kidding. <coughs> interesting. Very interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I cannot see. Oh, I'm so crashed. Quickly, Mandis. Find the entrance nearby. The children weep in the darkness, and the flood waters continue to rise. Mm. Reverse. Note. In order to facilitate assimilation of tissue groups, a compound is required or the cells will not work. Disposal of non-bonded subjects must be immediate and using incineration or we risk continuous animation without form. That is unpleasant. A simple compound of one part of Brennenberg infusion vitae to one part orgone munod dispersal fluid is sufficient. Oh, just things we have around the house, you know? Yeah, it's just a simple recipe. It's fine. This can then be administered intravenously to subjects following reassembly to maintain bonding. The compound is unstable and highly light reactive. Once in the body, the Schumann lamp can be used to activate the compound, but outside the body is highly corrosive. It can even destroy small quantities of a metal. That sounds safe. Let's use that. That sounds great. Welcome back, Alice. I fell down an elevator. But it's fine, I'm a strong boy. Always on the hunt for notes. Glasses. Okay. All snap, right? I'm I am strong. It is fine. Everything is okay. What is this? <sighs> oh! All right, bet. Warning, inflamed it is, burning it does, bleeding from each hole, fore and aft, leaking down my legs, blood and excrement, my lungs are in my vault. Ew! I blast cloths of my organs now onto the filthy stone. Drink this, he says, and I did drink it, I did do that. Because of the changes, they ripple in, inner, inner me. My teeth sneeze out and scatter like mice in the dark. I cannot find them all, gather what I can, push them back into my gray gums with my fingers, but the nails are all weepy and falling out. Drink it, he says, it'll help the running of the fever. Because not us all can take the change. On the other table, a beast under a blanket. I never wanted to see under that, but he drank it too. He passed it under the blanket, and I heard it drink. Dear God Almighty, how can a man shit so much blood and still live? That sounds disgusting, sir. Why did I have to read that? Okay... Oh, there it is. The canister. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Take it. Take it, I said! Put the canister... Oh, in here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 
Okay, I think that's all I need to do. I died, apparently. Okay. What? It fell onto his hands and they eroded in front of me. Uh-huh. To stumps. To stumps. Uh -huh. Next time we will use an equal mix of infusion vita and orgone disperser. No, no, just take him out. You can dump him in the river for all I care. August 20th, 1899. Took delivery of another batch of imbeciles today. <laughs> oh my god. They are the sorry specimens of humanity I have ever seen. No one asks where they go to. Authorities of Bedlam are simply happy to reduce their overcrowding in their teeming, stinking halls. We measure their skulls, check their teeth, we give them ladonum to pacify them. They wait in line, livestock, dull brown eyes and filthy skin. Many soil themselves as they wait. Into the manipulator they file in silence. I hear the hissing of gas. I hear the dull grinding of teeth that as they are removed, as bones are reset. I hear the pigs screaming. We have removed all the mirrors. After the process, it is their reflections that trouble them the most. Afterwards, when they sleep, I walk amongst them. My children, I whisper to their dreams. You are my children now. I have children once again, and your forms and perfect will be the engines to make my own blood flood once again. What? What the frick is going on? Over there, place it in the corner. What? Do you think I speak Prussian? Do I look like an inbred hog, sir? Who gives a damn what it Ooh. contains? Just set it down carefully and this leave me be. Asshole here. Damn. Okay.
Excuse me? August 4th, 1898. More experiments with Compound X. Took the dog and injected it with strychnine. After the expected convulsions and spasming, it died just after midnight. Why would you do that to the poor dog? I immersed the body in a large tank of Compound X and introduced an alternating current via induction coil for a period of three and a half minutes. Partial return was induced, however damage occurred prior to death was retained upon revival, meaning the dog contained continued in the acute state of of streak nine poisoning until I put a bullet in his skull, but drowning? Perhaps yes. It is after all known to the kindest of suicides. If one were to drown, replacing the fluid in the lungs with compound X should theoretically be perfectly possible as a revival method. Poor doggo. I know, right? Poor doggo. Sadness. There's one missing. Eh? There's one missing. Do I need to do a do the same thing again? How did I get trapped? I didn't get trapped before. What the heck? How dare they? That's one of the pigs. But I gotta figure out how to get back.
fine. I know when to get out. Alright, bye. <laughs> See you later. Okay, cool. I can see again. Uh, so I went through that way. Is there another canister this way? I need one more. Like, just one more. Oh, I guess I can just keep- What? I can just keep grabbing him? Wow. Okay, well... They didn't tell me that! I thought it was a one-time thing! Rude. Okay. Fine. Oh, well. Uh, get, uh, get in there. No? It won't take it? What? Maybe, maybe not. Okay. Maybe there's a special one that I need? That's really weird. Oh! It combines these two together to make this. Okay. 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 All right. Oh, all right. Okay. All right, cool. Uh, I suppose I'm going up now. Uppy stairsy. You, dare I go into the lab? Oh. Oh. All that was to break the lock? I, it's still locked though. What do you mean? Wait. Eh? Eh? I broke it. Help. It won't let me go through now though. It could be that it takes time? Uh, how much time? I don't know. Oh, wait, what? Ah! Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. I got it. Don't worry. I got it. Down here, Daddy. Faster, faster. I'm trying, kid. My old bones only go so far. Oh, that's fall damage. More fall damage. This leaking world. The bottle of gin was empty. Sleep seemed impossible. Above the skyline of London, he could only see the temple rising into the smog. Yes. Oh, yes. Indeed, yes. <laughs> I don't know why this game makes me like this. Why am I like this? Isn't it dangerous allowing this filthy discharge to collect so close to the core? We can use the flow to drive the turbines. There will always be a torrent of excreta flooding through these tunnels. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. God, the stench! This fecal matter is the true product of the age.
August 1st, 1899. Several of the older forms have breached the, their containment area and escaped into the sewers. They remind me of my limitations. This is no Kelm, and I know Aliaha. Aliahu? I. Aliahu? <laughs> Who? I, this is a reference I don't understand. Somebody look this up. It's lore somewhere. At least not quite yet. It is the heat generated from keeping the doorway between open that is to blame. We cannot simply pack them about the coolant as we do at the center where the doorway is. The latter versions are kept safe- <laughs> The lore! By the freezing temperature of those towers. Up here where the air is hot and fetid, they became overheated and their duality tears from asunder. As the other place flies from their cells and their vitae splinters. They live sporadically, tor torn from one world to the other and back again in violent, unpredictable bursts. For a few seconds, they are creatures of this world, then they are torn away and cease to have physical form. This vicious, rippling... Is it vicious or vicious? I think it's vicious. Rippling back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I'm going pretty insane myself. I have ordered the affected area sealed and will not allow my loyal workers to enter. They are, these are damn places now, the abode of failed experiments, ghosts of fear and spirit. And yet, in spite of all that... I'm still here. I got the sluice gate one open. That's good. Um, Supposed to go. I guess I was supposed to go through Sluice Gate One. I don't know. Sure. Something keeps solution around in the darkness, and I don't appreciate it. October 22nd, 1899. Naturally, once bled, the product must be scalded, dehaired, and scraped, ready for gambroiling, gambroiling, and evisceration. For this, we pass through, through the steam reservoir, which is kept at a constant temperature by passing excess high temperature venting from the engines. Via the boiler, it's a series of large copper pyres and pipes into a stone chamber just below the workhouse. At the center of the machine, there is a component that must be kept at a consistently low temperature, which controls operations of the processing of product at the system. Alongside this, refrigeration is of the utmost importance of retaining product quality. This also requires heat to be removed from certain areas of the machine. Two problems are therefore combined into a single solution, the removal of heat from some areas and the requirements for increased heat in others. Conducting panels draw heat using the principles of convection regulated by the boiler and sending freezing air along one of the pipes in one direction and superheated vapors in another. I... I'm too dumb to understand what you just told me, but okay. I... I agree? Question <laughs> Do I agree? I don't know. It's me. Wait. Wait. Oh, 
Oh, take it from me. Cool. But we can save them. We can set them free. We can replace a rotten old world with a clean new one. Mr. Landis, you sound every bit the fanatic. Well, how can I be otherwise, Professor? How can any man of ethics simply stand by and watch this world drown in its own excrement? And your engineer. This visionary with whom you have embarked upon this course, does he share your views? Indeed he does. Indeed he does. The poor fellow has seen it all before. Now, this is not this the is first great civilization he has wept for. And so you set about things immediately upon your return. Naturally, naturally. These things cannot be left to rot upon the tree. And sponsors were remarkably easy to find. I tell you, Professor, a trail of greed brings rich men to your door like pigs to truffles. So you say, dear sir. And yet, we're still in England, I suppose. Uh, I am very lost. Um, that's where I picked up the gramophone. Okay. I don't know where I've been. Um, I think there's another set of tunnels that I haven't gone down yet. And that's where I'm supposed to go. February 17th, 1899. As I and I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, yes, we see it. A tall, weathered cap of a steep-sided pyramid, so like those of Egypt. Stone falling away from the summit, vines curling about intertwining the stucco serpents that thrive among the steps. A palpable sense of stillness, a weight of forgotten. And this here, this is where the king sat. This is where the priests lived. This house, this is the house of the dead. And here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw their hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings, they most certainly were not savages. You see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether, or perhaps their tragedy was they could simply not spill enough blood to prevent the sky from falling in upon them. Okay. 
Nice off music. Fall damage helps. I made it! Through the next chapter! From Tide to Spine. And who is that third, that shadow, that spirit child in the background? That barely formed, that changeling, that almost lived, that never missed? <gasps> the cut! <laughs> okay. You seem to have undergone quite a profound conversion in Mexico, Mr. Mandel. You could not have seen it yourself and not, Professor. As we disembarked, even through my fever, I saw the detritus of this so-called progress. I saw starvation and disease, rot and destruction polluting the waters of the Empire. We are ruiners, you and I, and all of us, and we make the world unclean. And you took it upon yourself I to say act as Drag myself deeper into the temple, downward ever, towards a wind that held the voices of my children, beckoning me to set them free. Oh, I saw that. Better not. Go, go. Oh, Jesus. 
Don't do that to me ever again. <laughs> God damn. Woo. Okay. All right. their valves. Looks like it's locked though. What this? Put the wheel somewhere, right? Oh. Huh. What about now? No. No! Another missing gear? There's another one? <gasps> right here. Yes. There we go. The fall damage, my dudes. Oh. I see. Yes. Well, there's nothing down here, so why did I even come down here? Why did I waste my time? So loud, I hate it. That was a fast chapter. The children dancing. The stairs are steep. The sun beating on his neck as he pulls them up. The veins pop up on his foreheads, but he cannot deviate. He is a man driven by love. Only love. Only love. All we need is love. Apparently. <sighs> Open the door. This is... Oh, look. Looks like a witch's broom. All we need is love, yes! Just love, that's it. March 15th, 1899. Curled into my bunk, all sick and sweat ridden. They clean my room about me, but I can only hear the voice from within the greatest. the greatest. the gentlest of stones. Are stones gentle? Da 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 da. 
It seems to me, and I dream of a great machine. We will build a new world. From the ruins of the old, we will plant flowers in the rotten ribcage and let them grow to the hold the sky from falling. I remember how it whispered to me as we rolled sick and heaving, and I remember when we pulled into Southampton and we both wept, for it was every bit as much as desecration as he had been sung to me. And then we came to London, and I set it upon the mantelpiece, and went into the house, and gathered the servants, and set on recrafting them. And then I went into the garden, and buried those tiny scattered skulls under the weeping bulges of the rhododendrons. As you murdered the maids? Is that what I just heard? You murdered the maids, and then you hid them in the plants that they take care of. That- that's what you're telling me. Okay. Okay. Alright. Good morning! Um, I hate to break it to you, buddy, but, uh... It's, uh, it's afternoon. It is 8pm here. You set me upon a mantelpiece, and then you went into the house and gathered the servants, and we set you and I on crafting them, and then you went into the garden and buried those tiny shattered skulls alone. I wasn't wrong, though. It is indeed after to spare new. In the world you have created for us all. Aw, oh, thanks, Alice. That's sweet. Oh my god. Mine was playing something other than Beat Saber. Oh my god. We're gonna have to call the cops on this. Mm -mm. This is not allowed. This music, though! Jesus! Well, that was a transition. Oh Dear Christ, what is this place? You're asking that now? You're asking that now? You know how long I've- <laughs> You <sighs> Why are protagonists so dumb? Why are they so dumb? <gasps> Send help. Send help. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. You're right, you're right. Snacks, you're right. Alright, I have some Oreos. <gasps> Guess what, guys? My mom bought me snacks. I haven't had snacks in weeks. You're dipping your peanut butter sandwich in milk? That does not sound good at all. Cause then it just makes the sandwich all soggy. But I agree that eating peanut butter sandwiches and drinking milk is a good thing. Yeah. Mm. I don't know. I don't know about that one. But okay, you do you. You do you. I ain't judging. Oh my god, I can't keep up with all these redeems! Help! I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> Alice. What are you talking about? I didn't redeem nothing. What do you mean? <laughs> so I'm eating an Oreo. As my snacky. <laughs> oh, Alice, we love you. I don't have milk with me, but I have water. <laughs> I 
I'm not gonna dip my Oreos in water. No, I eat them by themselves, man. I also have some apple cider, but that does not taste good probably after. Unless, what if I dipped the Oreos in the apple cider? Is this big brain time? Is this the new trend? Is this the new thing? <laughs> I don't know. All right, stretchies. <clears throat> you know what? You're right. You're right. Do it again. You're right. Another snack, another tea time. You're right. I'm gonna try it. I mean, it doesn't sound terrible because it sounds like it would just be like a pumpkin spice kind of thing or an apple pie flavored Oreo, you know? It doesn't sound terrible. It's not bad. It literally just tastes like an apple apple pie flavored Oreo. That's not awful. I love that, actually. Alright, bet. That was pretty good, actually. I... I would eat that again. Hey. Hold up. Uh, boop the snoot. Okay, 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 okay. Where's my boops? There they are. Boop! Beep! I booped your snoot, Alice! If I get booped, you get booped! This is how it works. Everybody gets a boop. <laughs> and then we howl. <clears throat> Ow! Yeah, will. And then I get the head back. Head patties! Head patties! Yes, 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 yes. Pata, pata. Pata, pata, pata. Finding the children. What if I don't want to find the children? Why does that symbol kind of look like the symbol? Okay, maybe it doesn't. For a moment, it kind of looked like the symbol from Resident Evil 4 for the Los Luminados, but it's kind of extended. If they took the Los Luminados symbol and they flattened it a little bit into an oval shape, that's kind of what it would look like, I feel like. But anyways, that's my opinion. It is probably wrong, but that is okay. And they feel no pain. The process is completely humane. Humane, Professor? That we judge the acceptable level of suffering by the human condition? Ask the beggar, Professor. Ask the orphan. Ask the whore. Ask the starving, Professor. The weak, the sick, the filthy. Ask them to define your humane. Oof. There's some, uh... There's some conflicting views going on here. Alright, hats off. You're right. I have this. I have this. Magical transformation of which Okay. Head pata 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 pata. Nude forehead pats. You're actually petting my hair, actually, but you know, 
you can see it however you want, I suppose. Compound X. Oh. Oh, I see. That's what was stopping the switch from turning. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. We still need to finish Night in the Woods. <laughs> I've already played it, but... Oh! Heck. Both lead to the same direction. Oh. Quickly, quickly, the air is thin. The little voices tell no matters. They suffocate. They suffocate. Do they? Daddy, Daddy! What? Are you. Listen. It's not polite to bang on things. What have I told you, son? Now, Mandus, set them free. Set them all free. Who am I setting free? What a, what a, what a? Betrayal. I live. I breathe again. I rise. I will rise to bleach the sky and steal the water. I will spin the world wheel and set the future upon the path to redemption. Where are my children? You promised me my children. My time is come. More pig. More pig. What? Boys, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. They've been dead this whole time, haven't they? Ew! 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 Yeah, he betrayed me. He said he was gonna take me um, to my kids, and then he's like, nope, I'm just gonna make you revive me. Instead, your kids are dead. Manda's saboteur. You can't come in. No, you can't come in. You must sleep in the yard, bad piggy, dirty piggy, stinking, filthy animal, you bad child, you stinking child, you filth. What the frick? That's gotta be the villain, like, making these intro, like, text things. Yeah, so, uh, those- that's the ghost of my kids, um, that have been speaking to me this whole time. Oh, I need light. You're right. I can't and see. emerging, I raised my head to an uncaring sun, and I cursed this world of pain and despair. This civilization built on the ricketed 
bones of the unfortunate, on the greed and swell of mammon and empire. Cradling a stone egg in my jacket, I kissed my children farewell, and I crawled my way home. All oh, my kids dead, push me to the ledge. Now this music is gorgeous. Hello kids. Oh! Twenty-ninth of December. Can a man construct himself anew? Can a man on realizing who he is and what he has become tear himself apart down with the bricks and begin again? Are our souls just this? Tiny cogwheels and clockwork and intricate machines to serve a function that, upon reflection, we might set to a new task. Can a man, defined by his actions, defined by what he now finds abhorrent, set to sabotaging this body and his machine, till those children of his soul turn a new motion? And he may awake to a new sun, a new year, a new century with hope in his heart. As I reach my hands to the exposed wires, I ask myself this. Is redemption possible for such a creature as I? And if not, then surely better to die amongst my creation than continue to live as a monster. Speaking of, is the game too loud? I feel like it's really loud. Should I turn it down? I know it's kind of weird for me to be asking at this point, but... It's fine? Okay, maybe it's just loud on my end. Where are they? Where are my children? Why do you ask, Landis? You know the answer well enough. You're doing? Do you think I will allow you to sabotage me again? I want my children, you unholy bastard! Ooh, Papa's like, listen here. <laughs> August 31st. Children really are the most wonderful, useful creatures. Those unfortunates from the orphanage have proved indispensable in cleaning the larger steam pipes. <gasps> he was doing child labor! Fears that matter from the slaughtering process may indeed vaporize its source, but drifts like dust through the air and indulges in lodges in the pipes, causing them to foul. Periodically, we shut the pressure down and send one of our pixies into the pipes to scrub the reconstituted fat away. Armed with just a shortened broom, our little explorers venture into the dark. Of course, we can only keep pressure down for a short period, so they must be fast or they risk being trapped and boiled by the superheated vapors when they rush back into the system. Then we will be sending their comrades in afterwards to scrape free the cooling mess. The survivors tell me that you can reach all manner places within the complex through the pipes. I smile, tell them I am so proud, and then beat them to the pit. Good. Great. Fabulous. Okay. I guess I gotta go back down. Wait. The area. Yeah, there's nothing else here, right? Makes me nervous. Wait, there's something else here. Eh? There's another ladder?
Okay. Oh, I can go around. Oh, okay, I see. Will it hurt them? A cleansing fire always burns, little Mandus, but it purifies and it makes anew. Did it hurt to carve out the fevered flesh? Did it hurt to cut free the gangrenous foot? Ask instead this. Can we save them? When did I say that? That is not me. That is not me! I cannot see. I cannot see. I don't think anyone is getting saved. I am liable to agree with you here. <laughs> I feel like everyone is dying. Now we see. I, I cannot see. There is a spoon of medicine, I says, and a silver spoon which you did. that you did get born holding, I'm assuming. Ever so painful for mummy dear, but grasped so hard it was a little screaming red, fir red fist. Later you used your spoon to dig a hole in the garden to get all the way to Mexico, and then you did eat worms with your spoon all the way to stay fat. This spoon was the same you gave your twins, then used it to dig a hole to their clockwork souls, and you ate up their hearts like soup on the way to keep you fat. Fat little mole, where you will you dig next, I asks. You and your little silver spoon made from the silver spine of your children and wrapped in the air, hair of your deadly departed, dearly departed, dear sweet Jesus, my darling Lilybeth, what am I become? I have no freaking clue. Oh! I... Okay. feeling once I get all these pipes something's gonna happen so I'm making a note of where everything is. see anything anyway, so I guess I'm just gonna wing it. It's more fun when you wing it, right? It's more fun!
But Pig Man cannot see me! I am invisible! Okay, well, I'm just gonna run. Up, 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 up. Be finishing the game tonight, guys. You finish, you profit my viscera. We make you escape forever. You slit the throat, bleed out the pig, and it release into the curdle. That you set your species free. <laughs> Try to stay alive. I'll do my best. I've only died once, and it was really odd. Like, one of the monsters kind of like spawned out of nowhere and destroy me before I can even see it, and I was like, what? I, think, I feel like it was a bug, but... I don't know. It was really weird. Yeah, I wasn't like... Tr oh, Jesus. That's a lot of pigs. October 25th, 1899. No one misses the poor. Round up some orphans and the world will thank you for it. The sparrow whore and a gentleman applauds you. Call a beggar and a lady walks safely again. I hate them. I hate them more than any of the others. This privilege, this pretension, these so-called leaders, these pillars of society, these rich and fanciful. They wear their filth on the inside, but they are no less dirty. I have plans for them all. We will feed them and we will be freed from them. Blah, ha, 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 ha.
Anders. This is what you plan. much Never happening children. right now. <laughs> I'm pretty sure your kids are effing dead, my sir. Have we not discussed this? <laughs> Listen. I'm not toxic, I swear. There was things happening. I was trying to focus. Farming the world. Let us not be coy. I will not let us drag this corpse of civilization into a new century. But, hi, sad man. How you doing? We're getting close to the end, I me feels like. Me thinks. Me thinks. How's the stream? Pretty good, actually. Uh, this game's getting intense. Like camping. Be the first yes, time, and uh, ooh, drained and you gotta make me feel terrible. I flesh. swear I'm not bad person. The, the, the word, how will we save them? Show me these worthy Mandus. Show me these good. I do not see them. I'm already doing the wolfie pads. I'm so sorry. I'm already doing the wolfie pads. You want me to give you your points back? I don't know how to do double pads. What do you mean? You want me to turn off the pads and put them back on? <laughs> oh. the pads all right how do I how do I do that uh, blah, 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 blah. can I I will find a way hold on there's a way to duplicate paste Okay, hang on, hang on. I think I got two now. Hold on. Hold on. One on each ear. Alright, bet. Hey! Alright, like there. And there. Like, they're almost like little... 
<laughs> little bows on my ears. <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> it works for me, I guess. Cool. Alright, so we exit. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. Can I flip it? What do you mean exactly? You mean flip the left one? Or the right one? I don't know which one is which. The left one or the right one? So they're facing each other? Okay. Uh, transform. Flip horizontal. There we go. That good? I can move it down just a little. There we go. There we go. It looks like a little head massage. <laughs> a little head massage. Nice, yes. Very nice. Not supposed to do that anymore. Okay. I know you, machine. I know what you fear. I will rain excrement into your very soul. I you. will destroy you. Don't do you that. You are too low, Commanders. My great works are almost begun. Disgusting. I'll be lurking. Okay, have a good lurky. Screaming or yelling, I guess. That's not screaming, it's more yelling. 
Who is yelling? I'm trying to have a good time. I am here again, at the foot of those stairs. Towards the red light of the nursery. Sunset in the window like a bleeding sky. The horizon a slit throat. The seeping dark to drain the guilt from us. I am the jaguar-faced man. I am the feathered serpent. This priesthood is mine. I can meet him, your great engineer. How marvelous. I must say, Mr. Manders, my excitement is almost unseemly. Yes, I can see that. Step this way, Professor. I will be right behind you. Manders. Manders, where the devil are you? I can't see a damn thing. Manders! We are the pig, Professor. We are all the pig. Hello, kids. I climb in stillness now. Blue water runs in my veins, now I am clean. I carry the knife of this factory, the bowl of this mill. I am come to collect you from your fields and your furnaces. I will gather you into the white clouds. I will gather you to me, and I will take you home. Good. Love the blood, Blake. This is lovely. This is actually giving me, um... I don't know if anyone's played The Evil Within 2, but there's a scene where you're, like, crossing this literal, like, blood... valley. And you have to traverse through it to get to... I think it's like a door on the other side. Very similar. The veil lifts, the bride is waiting. Round up some orphans in the world will thank you for it. To spare a whore and a gentleman applaud to you. Call a beggar a lady walks safely again. That's something I've read, yeah. Interesting. Hear me, Mantis. My gears are adjust. My steam is built. Soon I will spill that blue water and split the egg, the atom, my soul. And there will be a very great burning that we might make the world clean. Be proud, for this is your doing. Until you steeped me in the blood of your own, I was nothing but rotten architecture. You have made me, and I will make the world anew. I don't trust anything this man says. For good reason.
I cannot see, I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Good to know. This is starts me right here. I was not aware of that. I pushed the lever actually, but I did. Descending amongst the spirits. I deny you. I am not your chattel. I will not be your operator, the monkey to your organ grinder. Damn. I feel like I've done most of the heavy lifting. Only to save you. Only to spare you. I would have given my soul to spare you this world and its loan. Oh, my children. My children. What have I done? What have I become? I will put it right, my darlings. All of my wrongs will be righted. All of my sins washed clean. I love you, my darlings, and I am sorry. I am sorry for all I have done. I simply loved you all too much for this world. That sounds like an excuse. misguided crusade and let me save them you may hate me mandus but i have seen the future your 20th century and let me tell you this a far greater slaughter awaits you there i seek to save the world by blood now before millions fall beneath history pushed under by blade bullet and gas oh Oh, Jesus. Oh, what the heck? He was the other way! Okay. He was the other way. That was bullshit. I saw him! You piece of shit game!
Okay. Woo. Um, pardon me. Oh, okay. Edwin Oswald and I. I think Enoch's the bad guy. Edwin and Oswald, I think, are his kids. No, wait. Madness, listen I to don't your know. heart. You know you are with me. You created me to save the world. I am your friend. I am no more evil than you. We sought the same thing, to save humanity, ridding them of their painful, stupid, pointless lives. Mandus, stop. Think about what you are doing. For your children, Mandus. Do not speak of my children, monster. I did not kill your children, Mandus. You sacrificed them on the temple steps, knowing what the coming century would do to them. Your sons will drown, lungs full of mud and shrapnel, on the banks of the song. You wanted to save them from the horror to come. That is the vision we shared. Everything we have built to avert this coming nightmare. You and I are one. We are the same. Our souls are as tangled. We deserve to make them free. Into faith. A child's shadow 
burnt into the brickwork. A house of skulls in the jungle. The innocent. The innocent Mandus trod and bled and gassed and starved and beaten and murdered and enslaved. This is your coming century. They will eat the Mandus. They will make pigs of you all. And they will bury their scalps into your ribs. And they will eat your hearts. No, for your children. I lay there and watched the god I had created die. At the end, when we were cold as the stone we had hewn his body from, when the lights were nearly all extinguished, we heard, in the silent distance, the man pig singing to one another. Then, as the last lights were gone, and we lay together in the deep, they drifted away, and all was silent. Such a silence I have never known. And as the dust settled on my open eyes, and we lay together embraced forever, I heard, miles above us, the sounds of the city turning over in its sleep. A church bell ringing out. And in that moment, the new century was born. his company. It's a meat processing factory. Wow. Hmm. I did it! I beat the game! Y'all? Honestly, it wasn't that long. But if I remember correctly, the original Amnesia, The Dark Descent, wasn't that long either. I think I beat it in like six hours. Um, and I think it, I've total, in total been playing this one around like five, six hours. So that feels about right to me. Wow. Yeah, and then there's um, Amnesia Rebirth, which I also will be playing. Oh, 
Wow. I don't know if I can skip this or not. Oh, I can. Okay, cool. I did it, guys. I beat it. I did it. I did it. I did it. Wow. Um, that was a unique experience. I still have no idea exactly what happened. Um, I just know they used the factory to, like, try to keep- try to turn people immortal or something? I really don't understand exactly, um, but they were doing some weird, messed up experiments um, on the pigs, which made the pigmen. But eventually, he chose to destroy it all. So. He chose to shut down the machine entirely, which destroyed all of it. Um, yeah. So how do I feel? I feel pretty accomplished. Um, I managed to beat the game. That's pretty good. Uh, now I can move on to the last game in the series, which just came out not that long ago, um, which I've been meaning to play for a while, so excited to get into that. Um, I'm excited to put a new game down and work on another one for a little while, but I'm really just exchanging one game for another, <laughs> to be honest, because I beat, um, I beat House of Ashes, but then I'm going to replace House of Ashes with The Quarry, and then I beat this one, and I'm going to start playing Amnesia Rebirth, <laughs> so <laughs> I'm really not winning here, but, but I am <laughs> at the same time. <laughs> but when I beat those games in the series, like, I can move on to new games, or like actually probably finish up games that I've been playing for a while and have not beat yet. <laughs> not me. I don't have long series uh, of like 40 some parts that have still been going on and I still haven't finished. No, absolutely not. Mm -mm. I don't do that. What are you talking about? <laughs> hey, Garashi. <laughs> Um, oh cool, the quarry is pretty cool, yeah, I hope it is, because I'm going to be playing it, so I actually just downloaded it the other day. Yeah, Houses of Ashes was, was, was interesting. The ending kind of confused me, but I still appreciated the game, I thought it was pretty cool. Anywho, thanks everybody so much for coming to stream. Thanks for the double head pats. That is something I never thought I would ever do, but here we are. Um, I got a full head massage going here. I'm gonna look at, uh, let's see. Look at, see who's streaming. We're gonna raid somebody. Let's see who's doing what today. I'm gonna try to find something spooky. So we can keep the spooks going. Okay, 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 okay. Looks very nice, the patapats, right? The double patapats. Uh, I actually just found someone I'm going to raid, unfortunately. Um... Uh, Because they're playing a game I really, 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 really like. I like Resident Evil 7, don't get me wrong, but uh, I really like this game. Also, somebody else I know is playing Resident Evil 7. That's funny. But, we are going to be raiding the lonely Kitsune, who is playing Little Nightmares. And Little Nightmares is absolutely one of my favorite games in existence. I adore that game. So we're going to be raiding them. Um, I don't know if I've ever raided them before. I feel like I have. But either way, um, obviously they're pretty cool if they're playing Little Nightmares. I love Little Nightmares. I actually uh, want to make a TikTok of, 
um, myself cosplaying Six from Little Nightmares. Yeah, so good. I love them both so much. I want them to come out with a third one. I want them to come out with a third one! <laughs> so much. Oh! Yes. Um, happy time zones, yeah. Have a good rest of your day, evening. Um, yeah, I'm going to be quitting this game and getting ready for bed because I have work again in the morning. I may do a cosplay TikTok before I go to bed. I don't know, but I do have an idea for it. So we're going to see. We're going to see what ends up happening. Um, but I will be back tomorrow with uh, FNAF Sister Location, part three. And we will be... Er, part two, maybe. I don't remember. I think it's part two. And we will be continuing on with the Spooktober. So thanks, everybody, for watching, and I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye!